Hi, my name is Anne Glass. I'm a reading and learning specialist at a private school in New York City, and I work with kindergartners through third graders on reading, word study, and writing skills. In addition to being a reading specialist and a learning specialist, I'm also a parent, and today I'm going to talk to you about topics in reading. Guided reading refers to a method of reading instruction in which one teacher will work with a small group of students, usually about four or five, um, all reading the same text. This would be a book that the teacher has selected that is going to be on the level of all of the students in the group, which also suggests another thing about guided reading, that these are homogeneous groupings. They are not heterogeneous, but they are based on um, the level of reading that each of the students is at in that group. The teacher will select a text and the students will take turns reading round robin style, with the teacher monitoring for accurate decoding and fluency. She might also interrupt periodically to ask questions about comprehending the text. Uh, students will take turns reading a page or two at a time depending on, um, on the text that they're reading and will often have to answer questions or have a discussion about the text at the end of the guided reading session. Guided reading sessions generally last about 15 to 20 minutes. Guided reading is a great way for classroom teachers to give individual attention to their students and have an opportunity for them to read orally, um, which often doesn't happen in a class of 20 or 25 with one teacher. While a guided reading session is going on, the rest of the class can be reading independently and uh, guided reading groups can happen on a rotational basis so that on uh, one day you might be your child might be reading independently and on another day, maybe once or twice a week, he's getting a guided reading session with an instructor. Mm -hmm.